What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video I'll be showing you step by step on how to draw the Black Panther mask. Let's get started by drawing a dot in the center of the mask. So right here we're going to start with a point. From here we're going to angle down and out towards the left. Go back to the center, angle down and out towards the right. And then from the outside we're going to curve the upper eyelid. Let's start with the left side. We're going to curve up and bend that out. Let's go to the right and do the same thing. Bending this up and then out towards the side. And then from the side of the eyelid, we're going to draw a straight angle line coming down and in. And then we'll close off the bottom of the eye. Starting back on the outside, we're going to curve down and then up towards the inside. Let's fill the eyes in black. I'm going to go back to the outside corner of the eyes and draw two straight lines going out towards the side of the head. So let's start with the left. Going straight out. Do the same thing on the right. And then from the outside, we're going to curve down and in towards the jaw. So coming straight down and then bending that in. We'll go to the right and do the same thing. Coming down and then in towards the same height. And then from the jaw, we're going to draw two straight angle lines coming down and in towards the chin. Let's start with the left side. Straight down and into right about there. Go to the right and do the same thing. Coming down towards the bottom. Let's close off the bottom of the chin. Starting back on the left, curve down and then up. Let's go back to the inside corner of the eye. I'm going to draw a straight angle line coming down and out. Start aiming towards the jaw. Do the same thing on the right. Coming down and out. And then from here, we're just going to curve this out and up towards the side of the head. Now from that inside point, I'm going to curve in and then down, aiming towards the outside corner of the chin. Go to the right and do the same thing. And then from here, it's going to angle down and out towards the side of the head. Let's add the center piece of the nose. Starting from the top in the middle, we're going to step down. Draw another straight angle line coming down and out toward the left. And then the right. And we'll angle it up and out towards the outside line. And then from that bottom point, we're going to step back up, draw a short line coming down and out on either side. And then go back up and out. Let's add the trim going around the eye. Starting from the top left, step out, curve down and then in the same thing on the right. And then from here we're going to draw a straight angle line coming down and in. Let's draw the inside of that trim. Starting back on the left, angle down and in. Do the sides. Now I'm going to connect the left and right side with a curve. We're going to go up in the middle and then bend that down on the right. Now I'm going to trace this trim along the outside. Starting from the outside of the head, we're going to curve in and then down on both sides. And we'll follow that same angle line coming in towards the inside. Now going back to the left side, we're going to follow that same angle line coming down all the way in to right about there. Do the same thing on the right. Let's come straight down on the left and right side. And then from the bottom, we're going to angle down and out towards the chin. Let's go back up to the top. Starting on the left, we're going to follow that same curve going across from left to right. Now we're going to add the trim across the jaw. Starting from the top here, the curve in, and just pull that down on the inside. Same thing on the right, and then we'll angle down and out. Let's go back to the outside corner. We're going to taper this in towards that line. And we're just going to follow this trim all the way down. Just come in with a straight line. 
and then we'll come all the way down towards the bottom. Let's move back up and work our way towards the top of the head. Starting from the inside of the eye, it's going to curve in and then up. Do the same thing on the right. And then from here, we're going to curve up and out towards the left. Go to the right and do the same thing. From the top, we're going to bend this up towards the top of the head. We're going to go up and bend that in. Do the same thing on the right side. And then from here, we're going to draw a straight angle line going up and out towards the tip of the ears. Let's come back down and draw the trim going around the brow. Starting on top of the left eye, we're going to draw a straight angle line going up and out. And the same thing on the right side. And we draw a short line going out towards the side on the left and right. Now from here, it's going to hook this down, coming down and in towards the top corner of the eye. Now I'm just going to curve this trim going back out. We go out and hook that up. Pull this back down, just tapering this back in. You just want to leave a little gap just on top of that trim there. And then we'll trace this all the way back up towards the tip of the ear, starting with a straight line coming in. Coming down and in towards the inside of the brow. And then we'll work our way around the top. Let's go all the way up towards the top. Just gonna go all that up towards the top. I'm just gonna taper it to a point. Now going back up towards the tip of the ear, we're gonna draw a straight angle line coming down and in towards the top of the head. And we'll close off the top with a curve. Starting on the left, we're gonna go up in the middle and then back down. Let's draw the inside trim. Starting over on the left side, draw a straight line going up. Do the same thing on the right. I'm gonna follow that same curve, going up and then out. And we'll pull this all the way up towards the base of the ear. Going up and then bending that in. Do the same thing on the right. Now this trim along the inside starts off thick along the top and gets thinner along the inside. So from the top we're going to step in, just trace that out along the inside. And then we'll add a thinner trim along the inside. Just coming in towards the middle. And we'll draw two straight lines coming all the way down towards the bridge of the nose. And then we'll add that seam across the center. Starting from the top and the middle, we're going to bend this out towards the left, come down and then back in towards the middle. Go back up to the top, we're going to go out towards the right, down and then back in towards the middle. Now we're going to go back up to the tip of the ears. I'm just going to round this out. Go around, then back down. And then from here, we're going to come straight down and then bend that in towards this point. Come straight down and then bend that in. Now we're going to go back to the outside and draw the side of the head. Let's start on the left. We're going to start by going straight up and then bend that in towards the outside edge of the ear. Let's line this up on the right side, go out and then bend that down. And then from the tip of the ear, I'm just going to bend the ear going out and then down towards the side of the head. Let's fill the inside of the ear in black. Let's add a few more details to the mask. Starting from the base of the trim, I'm just going to curve out and up towards the side of the head on the left and right. And then we'll add a simple pattern along the center. Starting on the left side, start with a straight line going up. 
do the same thing on the right, and then we'll angle up and out towards the side. And now halfway between this point and the inside, we're going to draw a straight line going past the top. And then again, we're going to angle up and out towards the side. And then from this line, we're going to step down, draw another angle line coming down and in. And then we're going to add a rib pattern across the top of the ear. Starting from this point, we'll angle down and out towards the left and right. We're going to step up and just draw that a few more times on the top. Let's do the same thing on the right side. Once more at the end. And that's pretty much it. There's our Black Panther mask. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and send me your requests in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.